Um, our next uh, speaker is a known legal analyst of Pakistan and has been mentored by renowned Pakistani human rights lawyer, late Madam Asma Jangir, as well as Mr. Ithazaz Essen. He's done extensive work in human rights and constitutional law and is the only Pakistani to have been specially invited by former U.S. President Mr. Jimmy Carter to attend World Human Rights Forum held in Atlanta, USA in the year 2018. Mr. Osama has also organized two-day international law training course for lawyers and law students along with several other international law lectures to spread knowledge on international law. I'd like to call Mr. Osama Malik. Honorable judges, respected President Lahore High Court Bar Association, respected Professor Nicholas, Dr. Pervez Hassan Saab, I, on behalf of the International Legal Affairs Committee, welcome you, uh, all of my colleagues, to this one-of-a-kind lecture delivered by Professor Robinson. I would like to extend my utmost gratitude to Professor Nicholas, who took out time from his busy schedule to address this gathering and share his deep insight on the subject of environmental law. I would also like to thank Justice Ali Bakir Najfi and Justice Jawad Hassan Saab, without whose support this event would not have been possible. Our country is facing a grave threat to its environment and is among 10 countries most affected by climate change according to the 2018 Global Climate Risk Index. Our country is facing ever-rising temperatures, drought, flooding that threaten not only health, agriculture, water supplies, but our hopes for development. We as lawyers have a huge role to play in safeguarding our environment and making it healthy for future generations. I am extremely proud to say that our superior judiciary has played a highly positive and active role in this regard. I was recently able to successfully defend a ban on non-biodegradable plastic bags before the Lahore High Court and as a result the use of these environmentally harmful substances have been prohibited within the areas administered by the Cantonment Board. For this, I am highly thankful to Justice Shams Mahmood Mirza, who gave this order on this serious issue. I would also like to encourage our legal fraternity to take up such issues. Lastly, I would once again like to thank Professor Nicholas for his presence here today and hope that all of you will benefit from his words of wisdom. Thank you.